world tip of the day. Got some older Horizons. I think these are 21. These are version 11, but uh, just going through, I'm making some adjustments on the TV7 displays now to just make it easier for the guys out here. Uh, a lot of people don't know this. I'm trying to talk over the compressors, but your main display on your TD7 doesn't always have the most pertinent information. So you can go in and edit these. You can see right now I've got all my good information on here. Discharge temperature, space temperature, high gas reheat, uh, all my pressures, uh, condenser fan speed, space humidity. Uh, I like that on my first page, especially for PMs. And just a quick checkup. If we go to edit, over here you can add and remove points. But if you were to choose that point and then use your up and down arrows, that will move that up the list. And when you're done and you're happy with where it's at, you can go back to and choose another point, grab it. As soon as you choose the point, you get your arrows here and you can move them up and down the list. When we hit save, we're gonna see our space temperature moved over here to the number one spot. So it will fill up one, two, three, and so on. Uh, just a little tip for you guys, especially if you don't work on too many of these, set up your TD7s, make it easier when you're looking at the uh, display on PMs and just a quick, good snapshot to be able to tell what's going on with the unit. And that way I've got a lot of my binaries off this main screen, so especially for PMs and such. Uh, just a good snapshot to come up here. I've got all my suction pressures, condenser fan speed, liquid pressures, uh, high gas reheat wind, space temperature, discharge temperature, all that good stuff, all the important things that you want to see on page number one.